Hello, everybody. Welcome to Minutes with PJ. Today's date, December 9, 2016. Our word for discussion is gospel in Romans 10, 15. And how will anyone go and tell them unless someone sends them? That is what the scriptures are talking about when they say, How beautiful are the feet of those who preach the gospel of peace with God and bring glad tidings of good things. In other words, how welcome are those who come preaching God's good news. 1 Corinthians 1.17 For Christ didn't send me to baptize, but to preach the gospel. And even my preaching sounds poor, for I do not fill my sermons with profound words and high-sounding ideas. For fear of diluting the mighty power there is, in the simple message of the cross of Jesus. In 2 Corinthians 2.14 But thanks be to God for through what Christ has done he has triumphed over us so that now wherever we go he uses us to tell others about the Lord and to spread the gospel like a sweet perfume. In Galatians one nine, I will say it again. If anyone preaches any other gospel than the one you welcome, let God curse fall upon him. Define this as the teaching or revelation of Christ, the record of Jesus' life, and teaching in the first four books of the New Testament. As a Christian, we are given a command to believe and to share the gospel. Scripture, which is the gospel, is inspired through the Holy Spirit. The gospel of peace will bring tidings of great joy. The gospel is the truth about Jesus Christ, the Son of God, and our salvation. If you preach the gospel of truth, God is always with you. I want you to think about this today. Have a blessed day.